The Amazon is a vast forest. Most of it is in Brazil. However significant areas of seven other countries are all covered by this forest including, Bolivia, Peru, Ecuador, Colombia, Venezuela, Guyana, Suriname and French Guiana. The forest covers the drainage basin of the Amazon River. One in ten of the world's known species live in the Amazon rainforest. The Amazon rainforest, also referred to as Amazonia, or simply the Amazon jungle, is the world's largest rainforest and, with an area of approximately 5,500,000 square kilometers, it represents over half of the world's remaining rainforest. The Amazon rainforest occupies the majority of the Amazon basin, which is the whole area drained by the river Amazon and its tributaries spreading from the Andes mountain range to the west, and the Atlantic Ocean to the east. The Amazon jungle is one of the least explored regions on Earth, and the home of over 300 different indigenous and ethnic groups of people. It is estimated that as many as 50 such groups exist, which have yet to make contact with the outside world. The majority of the Amazon rainforest lies within Brazil but parts of it extend into Peru, Colombia, Venezuela, Ecuador, Bolivia, Guyana, Suriname and French Guiana. The forest itself is described as an equatorial moist broadleaf forest and, although there are inevitably some regional variations from natural savanna to swamp, this is an accurate description for the vast majority of this area. The immense size of the Amazon rainforest can be appreciated by examining a map of the region. It is roughly the same size as the United States, but very little of it is inhabited. The rivers still form the major communications routes and, not unsurprisingly, areas of habitation are almost exclusively confined to riverside locations. The forested area is generally considered to be impenetrable jungle, and few inroads have been made. Although several million people live in this area, almost all live in urban areas such as in the Brazilian cities of Belém and Manaus with many more in Peruvian towns. The Amazon rainforest represents over half of the world's remaining rainforests. The trees of the Amazon forest supply over a third of the world's oxygen, and also take up huge amounts of atmospheric carbon dioxide. The river Amazon is the world's second longest river, but the largest in terms of water volume. Fresh water from this river flows out 200 kilometers into the Atlantic Ocean, and it is said that fishermen in the area were able to drink water from the sea long before land could be seen. Amazon rainforest dust, which gives the river its rust-colored appearance, originates from the Sahara Desert and is carried by the wind in huge quantities. This is the most biodiverse place on Earth and home to one in ten of all animal and plant species. To list all of the animals found in the Amazon rainforest, would require a work of encyclopedic proportions, and even that would be incomplete as there are many species yet to be discovered or categorized. On average, it is estimated that, a new species is discovered every four days. This area accounts for a fifth of the world's fish and bird species, over 2.5 million insect species, and thousands of other animals. Some of the best known are, the jaguars, sloths, spider monkeys, golden lion tamarins, giant anteaters, capybaras, pumas, armadillos, giant river otters, macaws, toucans, anacondas, boa constrictors, crocodiles, caimans, poison dart frogs, Amazonian giant centipedes, tarantulas, goliath, scorpions, Jesus lizards, hummingbirds, piranhas, electric eels, vampire bat, Amazon river dolphins, piruruku, harpy eagles and the list of animals found in the Amazon jungle could go on and on. Aquarium fish enthusiasts may be interested to know that, almost all of the popular freshwater aquarium species originate from this region. Just as with animal life, Plant species are incredibly abundant in the Amazon rainforest. The plant species present is almost endless but some commonly known are, rubber tree, Brazil nut tree, orchid, water lily, philodendron, bromeliad, heliconia, kapok tree, pitcher plant. The importance of the Amazon rainforest cannot be overstated, and it is often referred to as the lungs of the planet. Any intentional destruction of this unique habitat is therefore a matter of great concern. Deforestation has been taking place for many years and still continues albeit at a slower rate than previously. The major causes of deforestation have been logging for the timber industry, clearing of land for crop growing, and the use of land for cattle farming. Environmental concerns have resulted in the strict control of timber extraction, and farmers have been advised that increased areas of tree clearance do not result in increased profits.
The growing of soya beans is a major business, and until recently all forms of arable farming in the region have been hampered by the poor soil quality. The old way of dealing with this was by employing a slash-and-burn system of continuous tree clearance with the freshly cleared land used for a year or two after which time the soil would be depleted of nutrients. There are some very fertile areas where the soil has apparently been deliberately and systematically improved many years ago by the indigenous population. This soil is known as terra preta, and typically contains charcoal, manure and bone. The Amazon rainforest is one of the most remarkable places on earth but, despite its immensity, its very existence is a delicate balancing act. Severe droughts in 2005 and 2010 caused significant damage, and scientists warn that three successive years of drought could result in almost complete destruction. Climate change is usually blamed for the world's changing weather patterns but global warming also poses a great threat with predictions that an increase of 3 degrees Celsius could result in a 75% loss of rainforest. Thanks for watching the video. Please do like, subscribe and share this video to support our channel. Also do hit the bell icon so that you never miss any update from the upcoming videos.